Hey, what's good YouTube? Nate with Mass Collector, back with another video. I uh, just got back from a 10 day vacation down to Florida, Universal Studios, and um, Disney World. Did all the parks, basically a day apiece. Did Universal two days, because there's kind of two different areas there, but I um, want to make sure we caught both sides of Harry Potter. Wizarding World, which was awesome. Um, it was really cool. It was a whirlwind. It went by really fast. Did not see everything. Did not ride everything. Um, mainly because just, you know, I have a four-year-old, almost five-year-old daughter that just wasn't really into the rides so much. So we did a lot of just kind of walking around and looking at stuff. But, uh, but anyways, came back to a HGA box that I have here. And it's got nine cards in it. And um, I know what grades I got already, but these are all custom labels, so I'm not sure what they look like. But um, it would be cool if HGA did not put the grades on their emails. Um, just kind of got this email from them and I looked at it and then all the grades just kind of popped up in your face. So, <clears throat> but I took a look at those and had some pretty good results. So um, let's see what we got here what the labels look like and show you guys the grades I got. Okay. So first one here is uh, Kirill Kaprizov and these are from the Rookies box set that they, that Upper Deck put out. But on these rookies, um, Kirill Kaprizov's, on the face side, oh, that's cool. All right, that's a really cool label. It's got the Northern Lights on it. And I did again, I, I sent them, you know, kind of an idea of what I wanted to, uh, to get here. And I told them, you know, like Northern Lights and, you know, the Jersey colors, things like that, so. Um, get down in here. So, surface got a 10, corners 9.5, edges 9.5, centering 9.5. So, which is pretty, pretty nice to see a 9.5 on here. Um, I thought I was going to kind of get dinged a little bit just because of, if you get right in here, there's like cracking all the way around the edges. On these cards, I mean, you cannot see it with the naked eye. You have to get it, get in there with a uh, a magnifying glass. But I don't know if you guys can see that those little white cracks, just super, super minute, but they're there, right along the edges, about a millimeter in. Um, naked eye, they look fantastic. So I'm not going to complain about it. So I got nine five on this one. I got three of these total. Uh, the other one, the next one got a 9.5. Uh, these are slightly, um, bent a little bit. I think they've just been having issues with that. And the reason why I think is because the outer shell is a lot bigger than the inner shell from the looks of it. So, you know, you get more mass pulling on one side versus the other, it's just gonna happen. And then the other one got a 9.5 as well, so. So this one, this one here got a 10 on the edges, 9.9, nine, corners and centering, and surface got a 9. And then on this one here, corners got a 9, 9.5, nine, 9.5, five, nine, five, and a 10. So three 9.5s here, um, all the same label, basically what I kind of asked for. They look great. I love, I love the look of it. So super happy with those. Uh, next one is a Giannis Antetokounmpo. I got two of these and they are both the crust proofs with a gold. And I got a nine and I asked for this type of label again, which is kind of mirrors the, the other ones that I have. So the surface and corners got nines, um, 
edges, center rings, nine fives, and they obviously don't round up. So got a nine on that one. And also got a nine on this one. So two nines on these, but I think they look just fantastic with these labels. This one here got nine, 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 and nine, five, nine, 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 five, nine, five. So, Giannis is off to a pretty good start in that first game against the Nets. Uh, this one here is a John Collins. Uh, autograph out of 10, as you can see. It's a signature series. This is just a silver. So it's a silver, but we got a 10 finally from HDA. Um, as for the custom label again, just kind of said, you know, I like the look of the, the card. So, but it was, not, it was only a half a point away from flawless. Which, frankly, the flawless label I really don't care too much for. So, I like the looks of this actually better. But I came back really nice. And he just signed a big, you know, super max deal basically so that's good timing there um i've been collecting him for a couple years now uh next one up is dennis rodman this is a prism 2015 blue out of 199 and we got a nine on this one um label's okay you know they got red in there because of the jersey obviously in blue for the the border of the card um again the two nine fives and two nines on here so it just stayed a nine would have been nice if we got something better i mean the centering is definitely off so i, I get that and then we look at the corners there's a couple little dings here and there so i can see why it's got a nine and on a nine five or, or higher so looks like a good grade good looking card dennis is in my uh pc so Definitely a card I'm gonna probably hold on to. It's pretty cool. Uh, next one is Christian Wood, rated rookie. And we got a 9-5. Again, um, yeah. So three nine five scores and a nine on centering. The label color isn't the the best in the world. Um, why it has that purple hue to it, I'm not sure, but you would have think it would be more like this rated rookie color or the the label blue down there color. But otherwise, I mean, it looks good. It's more about the grade than anything, really. So, thanks to see a Gem Mint 95 on that. And then the last one here is a. Um, Contenders. This is a Contenders and it's a numbered out of 25. Ooh, that's kind of cool. So this is, uh, yeah, number 13 out of 25. It was close to getting a 10 too. It was only half a point away from getting a 10. So got two 10 scores for the edges and surface and then the corners and centering got 9.5. So happy with that one. Looks pretty sharp. So happy about that too. So um, overall, pretty happy with the submission. Um, you know, nothing low, lower than a nine, which was uh, nice to see. So happy about that. Um, if any of you guys have any questions or comments, please leave them below. I uh, appreciate you guys checking out the video. And also, um, if you haven't subscribed yet, please think about doing that. Catch more content when I drop it. Hit that bell and you'll be notified. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks, guys. Talk to you later.